What's up guys? I'm gonna be showing you how to um, stretch for cheer. So what you're gonna be needing to do first, you're gonna need a handy dandy bowl. Okay. Okay, and then or if you're if you're gonna be good, you can use like a railing also if you don't have a wall to like do if you have an upstairs also. So if you're a flyer also, this is a stretches for, so this is, these are stretches for you, okay? Okay, so let's put you right here. Okay, so you're gonna need to go ahead and straddle. Make sure your legs are straight. And hold this for a moment and reach to the right first. Then go to the other side and do the same thing. Oh, this leg's really sore for me. <laughs> then you're gonna come, wait, no. You're gonna reach to the middle. You can do pancake. Okay, now pike. your legs are tight and straight and point your toes and try to get your elbows on the ground while having your um while you're grabbing your heels and you're gonna flex pull them back of course you would have cheerleading shoes on, but like, I don't feel like getting them on on a day I don't have cheer. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna do right leg lunge. And then you're gonna straighten your leg, tap nose to knee. And then pull your leg back. Oh. Pull, well, pull your leg from the back one using your left arm and then you slide into splits. And you should be on top of your body. And your back knee should be flat on the ground. And you're, you should be able to bend your knee straight. Not to the side like this or the other side. You should be completely straight whenever you, if you have it. What? Like this. And then if you can, like try to grab it. Boom. I'm working on that one. Okay, and then we're gonna do left leg lunge.
close to me. For me, it's nose to ground. And then you're gonna pull your leg um, forward and forward with your right arm. With your knee on the ground still. And then you're gonna slide into splits with your knee on the ground. And arch your back a little bit. Then you should be able to bend your knee without it turning to the side. Now I have a problem with my knees, just a little bit on this side, so I can't get it all the way under, and so it like bends weird. But it's, it's how it would be with a normal person without their knee, like, incapable of doing it. I just arch back instead. Now I do middle split. Sorry about my sisters and brothers if you hear them. I'm literally gonna go to sleep. Good night. Okay. Um, and then I like to arch back also. It stretches a little bit like right here. And if you like, just helps. Um, and then I um, usually do my, um, I usually go to my railing if you have a second floor. Oh. And I do um, my high kicks. But then sometimes I kind of, maybe sometimes skip that. And then I also do sometimes, uh, well, done. There's my scale. And then um, come back over here. Should just stay over here though. And I do my five countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. 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 Four, three. Two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, two, three, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, 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 one. Then I um, do my leg holds over here without anything. Sometimes I hold onto the table just like this though. But sometimes I have my hand holding onto them back here. But, And whenever I go into the scorpion, I like having my foot like kind of flexed a little bit. Not too flexed though, to where it's like not right. <laughs> to where it's noticeable for the judges. I just flex it like um, 
so it's pointed and I and I um like flex it like a little bit not too much but yeah that's that's gonna be how I stretch for cheer and that might be for you also